Hello, Virgos. Welcome to Visions of Light and Love. This is your reading for the energy in September. This reading is for all of the Virgos out there. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. For the energy in September. If you are a returning viewer, welcome back. If this is your first time stopping by, welcome to Visions of Light and Love. If the reading does not resonate with your situation, check out your Moon, Venus, and Rising Sign videos. Cross Watchers are welcome as well. If you like my energy and my vibe, you feel like I'm the reader for you, and you want to show some support to this channel, hit the subscription link along with the notification bell and the thumbs up image to help this video circulate. If you need a personal private reading, the link to the email address is in the description box. Okay. All right, let's see what is going on with the sign of Virgo. Virgo, oh, Virgos, happy birthday. If your birthday falls this week, my mom's a Virgo, her birthday is Friday. So happy birthday to all of the Virgos out there. All right, so we have the Six of Wands, the Five of Wands, the Two of Swords, the Temperance, Sagittarius Energy. Some of you may be dealing with the Sagittarius or have Sagittarius in your chart. We have the Nine of Cups. The Eight of Wands, the Eight of Cups. Some of you have a new beginning coming in. The Three of Cups. Yeah, there's a new beginning here. And the Ten of Wands. Page of Pentacles at the bottom. Some of you are waiting for a message to come in. Could be pertaining to uh, money. Waiting for a message to come in pertaining to money. And. Or waiting for a message to come in pertaining to stability. Someone may be trying to get your attention, but they are conflicted about reaching out to you. That's what this message is. Someone wants to send you a message. They're trying to get. Your attention, but they are conflicted about contacting you because they may be blocked. Or if you didn't block them, the universe blocked and restricted this person from sending you this message. But there is someone here that is trying to get your attention. They want to reach out to you, but right now they are blocked with the temperance. You're just trying to maintain balance. That's your wish fulfillment. Is to maintain balance. To stay so low. And to focus on doing what. Excuse me. What you love to do. This person wants to come in quickly. To communicate with you. But you have turned your back. On this person. Could have been because of a third party situation. Could have been because of a third party situation. And now this your person is feeling overwhelmed, bogged down, feeling like they're carrying the world weight of the world on their back. This person, you may have children with this person. Someone is feeling as if someone is trying to get your attention. Someone, it's like all eyes are on you. Because this person wants to come in with a new passion at the beginning. This person may be thinking about having sex with you. Yeah, they want to come towards you to have sex. I feel like with the Vir with the Herman card, Virgo, this is you. You withdraw from, you withdrew your energy from this person to gain some type of clarity and enlightenment. And I feel like the clarity that you receive is that this person is a snake. 
This person was spying on you. Could have been driving past your home, your job, checking your phone. Someone could have been sneaking and checking your phone. I just heard that, and you cut them off. Or this could very much be vice versa, but now this person wants to come in with the new stable beginning. Or either you do, after feeling some type of disappointment and regret. I'm feeling like this person is feeling rejection because they want to overcome these obstacles that are in your way and have this conversation, but you have your guard up. This person is blocked on all angles. I feel like spirit is blocking this person. It could be a Taurus with their hierophant um, coming out. Spirit could have blocked this person. I feel like this person was talking about you gossiping, telling your business, or talking about what was going on in your relationship. And you may have overheard them or found out about it. But with the strength card, Leo's energy, you're attaining yourself. You're using, you're strong enough to uh, walk away from this person because they created a tower moment. The foundation of the union came crumbling down. And in it crumbling down, you learned your value. You, you, you realize how valuable you are. This person realized that you add to their life, not take away. They realize how much they love you once you walk away. Okay. Yep, once you walk away, they realize how much they love you. This person misses you. And they're ready to come in and work this out. They want to they wanna come back and revisit this, but things are stuck, suspended in the air because they caused a heartbreak. Could have been over a third party. And I feel like you walked away from this person so quickly. They didn't even uh, they didn't even know you were going to walk away from them. You some of you may have ghosted this person. You may have met this person at a job. This person, I feel like they made you look like a fool. They made you look like a fool because you you may have took a risk on this person. This person may not have been with uh, the type of person that you would usually date, and you took a risk on this person. And they had you in a third party. Now they're trying to come back in to put some effort in um, to, to, to revisit this. And you're like, no. Yeah, you're ignoring it. You're not dealing with this person. What other messages do you have? Yeah. This person is up at night thinking about this. They can't get you off of their mind. What's the outcome? They're waiting. This person is waiting to come back in. Yep. They want to reconcile. They want to give and take reciprocity. They're, they're, this person is coming back in. Yeah, they're waiting for a cycle to end so they can come in to start a new one. Where's that other card? Yep. They're listening to their intuitions. Initials can start with a J or B. If that's not their initials, I don't need anyone in the comment section saying what their this is not their initial. The initials that I'm getting is J or B. This person is listening to their intuition. They're waiting to take action, waiting for the right time to come in to balance this out. I'm sorry that comment was not for everyone. Sometimes people make comments, leave comments. I, they, they, people like to troll. And they, uh, people make comments that, it, that's why in the beginning, it says in the beginning, I say, if this reading does not resonate with your sun sign, check out your moon, Venus, and rising sign video. Paradise. So you make this person happy. They enjoy being with you. And people will still leave nasty comments. Or they try to anyway. Because I don't <laughs> I don't really let it bother me. But yeah. But like I said, this person was talking to you, talking about you to their friends. They this person was wearing a mask, putting on the front. They need this person with this Phoenix card. Someone needs to grow up. 
because this person had like feelings for you and I, I'm feeling like they were um, wearing a mask. Okay. Yeah. This person, someone needs to look in the mirror and reflect on their actions. Someone needs to look in the mirror and reflect on their actions. Let's see what else is here. What else is here? I'm scared because you mean more to me. So this person didn't know that they were going to fall in love. And they want you to know, thanks for putting up with me. But for as long as you did. But guess what? You're not putting up with them anymore. So Virgos, I am going to leave it at that. This is your reading for the week. The energy in September. Comment below. Let me know if this is your story. Share, like, subscribe. Hit the notification bell. Be safe. I am sending you love, light, peace, and healing energy. Thank you so much for watching. Enjoy the rest of your week, and I will see you next time. Bye.